Clinton Community College, in association with the Development Corporation of Clinton County, is hosting a new lecture series based on the economics of the North Country. Last week, Mark Beauchamp, Vice President of the Economic Development Group CAI Global, spoke on FDIs, or foreign direct investments. We look at it as an investment made by a company or entity based in one country into a company or entity based in another country. So we're not talking about investment made in the stock market. We're also not talking about global business hubs like Shanghai or Toronto. We're talking about Plattsburgh. FDI magazine named Plattsburgh the third best micro city for economic potential in North and South America. FDI cities of the future uh, ranking also featured Plattsburgh as a fifth for human resources and seventh for business friendliness. Knowing that 15.56% uh, um, uh, of the workforce are production workers, that's an interesting uh, statistic for a site selector. It tells me that uh, there is a lot of production uh, here in, in the area and that a manufacturer will be able to find uh, labor, uh, production labor for uh, its operations. And also 77% in Clinton County graduate uh, high school. Again, just telling me that uh, we can have access to a, an educated workforce. Though Plattsburgh is not a land unfamiliar with foreign direct investment, multinational companies like Schluter Systems and Swarovski have established subsidiaries in the region. Clinton County uh, can take advantage of existing opportunities and they can do that by gaining knowledge of its investors. Uh, as I mentioned, it's a new set of rules today. Uh, these companies are not necessarily coming from Canada or France, they're coming from China. So what is a Chinese company looking for? Uh, they're uh, living under a different set of rules economically and now they're looking to make an investments in the US. How do we approach a, a Chinese investor uh, from a Canadian or a French or a English investor? There are ways to make sure that uh, Clinton County uh, gets its way on the short list of investors, but you need to really develop those uh, marketing strategies and put forward that value proposition that uh, Clinton County is building.